WFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 1 p.m. Eastern time on Thursday, January 2nd, kicking off 2020. We're starting right where 2019 ended with a positive note for the markets. We have the Dow reaching a new record today, right now up 197 points, trading 28,735. S&P's up 12, trading 3243. We have the Nasdaq up 70 points, trading at 9,042. Gold contract up almost five dollars at fifteen twenty seven. We've got oil down sixteen pennies at sixty ninety. Notes and bonds, we're getting some lower yield and higher price. The ten year up six ticks at one twenty eight nineteen. The thirty year up twenty ticks at one fifty six seventeen. And some strength in the dollar index up three hundred and ninety one ticks at ninety six eight thirty six. We'll start things off. Let's jump over to the charts. We'll start it off with the headline of the day. Record as Wall Street's monster 2019 rally extends into the new year. A Dow record to start things off. And there's your Dow 30, 28,691. We reach a high right after the opening bell of 28,715, looking at the March futures contract. S&P 500 currently, excuse me, at 3,242. We're as high this morning as 3251.79. That's about two S&P points from an all-time high in the S&P, that high being 32.54. NASDAQ 100 trading at 88.42. There's your crude oil market now under $61. The price of crude trading $60.86. Gold contract, quite a day for gold as well, continuing the recent gains we've seen in the metal. 1533.88, the high at 1030, just off that level at 1527. There's your euro, 111.68, as we've seen dollar strength and euro weakness. I mentioned the note and bond market, and we'll pull things off as I get up here. Let's get a chart of the 10-year yield. Quite a volatile day to start things off in 2020, especially in the bond market. Checking out a chart of the yield. There you go. Early this morning, we make it up to a high of 1.944%. And just like that, we trade down to a low of one8 Four nine percent. You're talking about a tenth of a percent in the ten year in a matter of four or five hours. And we've got a bit of a bounce now, resting 1.88 percent yield on that ten year. Stay tuned, folks. We got a man, Steve Rhodes, coming up live right now with the Trader's Edge. Then we have Teddy Kegstat from forex-trading-unlock.com. He's going to be filling in for Dave at two o'clock, talking forex and Tom O'Brien live from three till four. Stay tuned, folks. We'll be right back.